Hey guys, this is Brian Rowe from Tweaktown. We're here at CES 2016 in Las Vegas to bring you guys some of the most expansive CES coverage on the web. Thermal Take was our first stop and they brought just about every product they had to offer. Known for being very popular and supportive in the modding community, Thermal Take had no shortage of exotic, colorful, fully custom water-cooled builds showcasing their previously released cases and their newly announced lineups of Core Series chassis. The X31 and X71 are mid-tower and full-tower chassis respectively, the full-tower X71 having room for a vertical dual-chamber configuration. The Core X5 and green Core X5 ring edition are dual-level cube-style cases capable of being stacked on top of each other for expanded cooling, storage, and multi-system setups. All of these are aimed quite squarely at the hardcore enthusiasts, starting in price at $139 MSRP for the X31 and going up with size and special features. They feature very large windowed side panels, multiple radiator support, and modular removable drive cages. The Core P5 is a beautiful open air vertical frame style chassis with a bunch of modular layouts and a huge acrylic window to protect and show off custom builds. It's actually available now on Newegg for $139, and this is fairly aggressively priced for its form factor and elegant looks. The W Series is Thermaltake's new Super Tower class of chassis and offers massive amounts of space for large motherboards, multiple cooling loops, and tons of drive. They also feature huge windowed side panels, wheels, and optional expandable pedestals. And they're priced fairly aggressively when compared to, say, Case Lab offerings. The larger Core WP200, which includes the pedestal, comes in at $549 MSRP. This pricing does come at the expense of not having a few features we're used to seeing in case lab chassis like removable motherboard trays and drop-in radiators for building outside of the case. But nonetheless, here at CES, Thermaltake has definitely shown their desire to give enthusiasts the chassis they want at pretty reasonable prices. Check the description for links to pricing and availability and other information about these products and let us know what you think of these chassis in the comments below. Be sure to subscribe for more CES 2016 coverage here on the YouTube channel and visit TweetTown.com for the most up-to-date CES news.